Hi there, Jacques with Canny Customer Success here. Let's go ahead and talk intercom. So our intercom integration, we actually use it here at Canny in-house, um, and there are two aspects to it. So first off, let's touch on this right here in the Messenger homepage. You can have people leave feedback right from there. Um, so you can go ahead and uh, vote. Uh, so your customers can go ahead and vote right from there. You can also, by the way, uh, search existing posts or customers can create a new post. So let's go ahead and say uh, custom statuses. There we go. So we do recommend existing posts, obviously. Um, so that way people can go ahead and leave that feedback. If you're noticing that flashing, by the way, um, that is an intercom issue. They have let us know they're working on it, but uh, my apologies if that's bugging you. Um, now let's go ahead and head back over here. So the other part of the intercom integration is going to be the uh, messenger app. So in the intercom messenger, let's say someone writes in and says, I want a dark theme. So you may have heard that little intercom click. So in our queue, we have someone here who is requesting a dark theme. Um, very easy to go ahead and handle that. Let's just send them a nice message and then I can use the canny app. Now, by the way, you can also uh, take a look in your other apps if you're not seeing it there. So canny should be listed. And canny does recommend uh, posts based on the keywords of the conversation so far. So I can just go ahead and add their vote. And there we go. Now I'll go ahead and send that and the user will get a nice message along with a receipt letting them know their feedback has been tracked. Uh, they can go ahead and view the full post. And from here, they can obviously add comments. They can participate in the discussion um, and add screenshots, all that kind of good stuff. So with that, let's go ahead and take a look at the voter list. So when you open up the voter list on the canny side of things, you're going to see this link to the actual intercom conversation. By the way, these are all fake names and fake accounts. <laughs> we take privacy very seriously around here. Um, so yeah, we do have that link to go to that intercom conversation and see the full context, see the full details of what was said um, for that customer. So that is very, very helpful for you to understand the full context of why does this user want this function? Why are they voting on that? Um, and also for you support people, uh, I'm a support person myself. Uh, this is very, very helpful. It cuts way, way down on uh, having to track things manually, updating spreadsheets, um, you know, uh, using intercom tags or things like that. Um, this is a great way to just track feedback and make sure that um, they are automatically then signed up for updates on that particular feature, function, or request. So we also have all kinds of helpful information in our uh, help section here. But of course, if you have any trouble or run into any issues, just feel free to go ahead and start a chat. There are humans on the other end of this, obviously. Thanks so much, and we'll see you in the app. Take care.